Good evening and welcome to A Night With The Jess Davies Band. I'm your host, James Court. Tonight, we'll be listening to two originals and a cover song from this amazing country music band. And I'll be getting to know them just a little bit better. Without further ado, here's their first two songs. That you know so well Where it's going Only time will tell Been down this long old road before Not the first time I'm knocking at your door Fool for love Why can't it ever be enough To young to love Too old to change Try it all again, but it's never the same. You can borrow my heart. Oh, why do we keep pushing our love? I've paid for love, fool for love. Why can't it ever be enough? Too young to love, too old to change. Try it all again, but it's never the same. You can borrow my heart. song is Mama Told Me. My mama said it to me when I was a little girl. There's not that much love left in this world. So when you find someone, take good care of their heart Because you never know when it could be the start I know your pretty little heart might ache But I promise you the pain won't last longer than a day Before your heart returns back to Sometimes the world don't seem fair But I 
Two great performances there from the Jess Davies band. Now, let's get to know Jess a little bit better. So, Jess, what drew you to country music in the first place? Um, well, uh, one day, like, four years ago, I happened to be in London, and they do this thing called Country to Country okay. um, at the O2. Um, yeah. And it's basically, like, a Friday to Monday, full weekend of literally just country music from oh wow. Nashville. Um, and I happened to be in London when that was happening. And I was kind of like, oh, what's that? Um, so I went and had, they have like three pop-up stages outside that you can just go and listen to music. Um, and I just happened to be wandering past. So I went in um, and I just thought, this is really cool. And everyone was in like cowboy boots and that's cool. tassels and hats and stuff. So I was like, I like this. It's the whole good. sort of scene. Yeah. <laughs> that's cool. A big part of um, country music in general is the lyrics. The writing's always very yeah. deep. Do you have a favorite country music lyric from a song? Um, there's a song, um, it's like my favourite country song, um, and it's called I Drive Your Truck. Mm. Truck very being very cliche for country yeah. music. Um, but it's a really lovely song about, um, someone who lost their son, and it's about, like, drive, whenever they get in the truck, they kind of feel like they're with him. Oh wow. Um, so I love songs that are like that, that kind yeah. of, a bit, a bit deeper, but they're, c they're really nice to listen to. Do you try and channel the sort of deep stuff into the songs that you write? Yeah, try to. It, it's kind of hard to, like, when you're kind of starting out in country, country's not kind of to everyone's taste, so you have to kind of make it um, not so cliche country with yeah. trucks and whiskey and stuff. <laughs> um, you have to try and make it a bit more um, to everyone's taste, really. Yeah, so. yeah, of course. Do you... Um, have you got any albums or singles, anything coming out soon or at the moment? Um, yeah, we're actually in the process of recording our EP. Um, Very nice. And hopefully it will be out uh, next April. Okay. Um, but yeah, so that should be very cool. Okay, perfect. How did the band like form in the first place? How did you find everybody? Um, it's kind of interesting. Um, my guitarist, Duncan, um, one day I got a, a, me a message on Facebook from a random guy. Um, and, you know, I was kind of like, hmm, do I answer this? And he was <laughs> kind of saying, I saw a video of you singing online and I really liked it. So um, I, want, I kind of want to meet up and cool. have a jam and see how it gets on. So I was a bit sceptical thinking, yeah. meet some random guy. Um, but we actually met at uni um, in a safe place. Oh, perfect. And he turned out to not be so weird. Um, and, yeah, and then we found Tally. Um, Tally's only been with us for probably five months. Okay. Um, but, yeah, no. Weird way of meeting. How um how long have you all been performing together as a group? Um well like I say with Tally about four or five months. Yeah. Um but me and Duncan were previously with another gu uh, bass guitarist, and we've been together for just over a year. Oh cool. How um what's the biggest crowd you've ever performed to, as your band? Um the biggest venue is the Hard Rock Cafe in London. Oh um, wow. But I, I don't know how many people are in there. 
Yeah, okay. it's, it's a nice big venue though. Yeah, nice. Do you have a uh, favourite um, on stage memory? Uh, definitely the first time we played Hard Rock Cafe. Yeah. That was really cool. Okay, have you played there a few times? Uh, yeah, and we've actually got a gig on Wednesday as well. Oh, nice. Um, what country music uh, artists inspire you and inspire the music you write? Um, oh, there's quite a few. Um, probably none that anyone will have ever heard of. <laughs> um, but there's someone called Brandy Clark, uh, yeah. who's amazing at songwriting. Um, Jesse Alexander. Um, yeah, they're probably my two go-to. I definitely recommend having a listen. Has um, has anything ever gone wrong while you're performing live? Um, my voice completely went once. Yeah. Um, I've actually got a bit of a cold today, but um, I ha I was <coughs> ill, and I tried to reach a note, and it was a bad idea to try and reach that note because once I reached <laughs> it, that was it, and literally nothing else came out. Uh. Um, so yeah. Were you able to sort of save yourself? And um, yeah, luckily my um, tally kind of stepped yeah. in and um, and carried on singing a little bit. Oh, does tally do a bit of backing vocals? Yeah. Yes, that was nice. lucky I had him that day because <laughs> otherwise it would just been Duncan playing guitar. Can we uh, can we find you guys on social media at all? Yeah, um, we're on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and it's just the Jess Davies Band. The Jess Davies Band. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Uh, well, thank you so much for joining us. Um, do you want to go and get ready for your final performance? Yes. Thank you for watching, everybody at home, for a night with with the Jess Davies Band. Please join us again for more epi episodes. I've been James Court. Good night. Our next one's going to be two songs mashed up, and it's going to be Keeper of the Flame and Jolene. I'm walking in their footsteps, I'm singing their old songs. Somebody plays his trail, I'm treading on. I'm bent, but I'm not broken, I'm stronger. Keeper of the flame, the teller of the story. Keeper of the flame, for the ones that came before me, for the little pile of lights waiting to ignite like fireflies in the rain. Keeper of the flame. Waiting for a wind to carry me and start a fire again. Sometimes I'm just a flicker, a candle in your eye, but I swear. Jolene, 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 I'm begging of you, please don't take my man. Jolene, 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 please don't take him just because you can. Your beauty beyond compare with flaming locks of open hair with ivory skin and eyes of emerald green your smile is like a breath of spring your voice is soft like summer rain and i cannot compete with you jolene and i can easily understand how you take my man but you don't know what he means to me Jolie 
Jolie, Jolie. 